Hey guys, it's Oso and we're here at the Pomona Fairplex in Pomona, California for the LA County Fair. We're gonna check out some awesome food today, some weird stuff, some delicious stuff, some crazy stuff. But at the moment, we're here with all the barnyard animals and we're gonna take a look around and see the countryside of things here in LA. Stick with us, it's gonna be a fun one. Hey guys, Osa from the future here. Unfortunately, the audio for this is uh, unusable, so I'm just gonna let you know uh, that we got ourselves some nitrogen-infused popcorn. Uh, super yummy, they kind of taste like fruity pebbles or uh, cotton candy. We had a couple of different opinions in the group. As you can see, I'm enjoying myself. Currently, I'm saying that they're fantastic and I'm recommending them. I do believe I gave it a uh, 4.5 overall. It's, uh, it's fun. It was enjoyable and I definitely recommend it if you have the chance to uh, check these out next time the LA County Fair is in town or if they're at your local county fair. So here we have Sebastian, Juan's friend, and he helps us out with a couple of, uh, of things here and there. He's, he's trying it. He's having a good time with it right there. And he's saying that I'm right about Fruity Pebbles. They taste like Fruity Pebbles. Does I, they taste exactly like Fruity Pebbles. So right now I'm, I'm, I'm telling the story of how uh, we, we ran into some trouble while we were at the fair. It seems we were unaware that uh, some prior acknowledgement of our being there to record needed to be made with the staff. However, uh, we did get ourselves our media credential thanks to a, um, a very nice uh, lady by the name of um, Renee. It, it was kind of a wild ride. We didn't know how to find her, but we, uh, we, we made it through and got ourselves our first uh, We Suck at Cooking media badge. Enjoy the rest of the episode. Uh, enjoy my ugly mug because I have nothing else to say. I'm just going to keep eating this stuff. We are here back at our table that we've commandeered with Juan. Uh, Juan's got an epic meal right here from a place called Tasty Burger, is that right? That's right, Tasty Burger. Tasty with a, with an eye. Uh, what did you get, Juan? This is the, the Texas barbecue burger, I believe. Then uh, what do you have down there? I wanted to get the, the spicy cheese curd fries, but I believe they misheard me when I ordered. So they gave me what's called the, the unicorn fries. And uh, I'm not exactly sure what's in this, but it looks really good. It smells good. So I'm looking forward to trying it. So uh, what do you want to start with, Juan? Fries or burger? Uh, I think burger. He's going to start with the burger and then we're going to get his thoughts on that. All right, here we go. The burger has uh, cheese, uh, all beef patty. We got some uh, onion rings. Onion rings. Looks like uh, we got some barbecue sauce as well. Got barbecue all over the face, as Carl's Jr. used to say, if it doesn't get all over the place. And you know the other part, I'm not getting copyright strikes for that. It's looking like it's uh, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be a good review here. I like it, it's good. Um, there's a good amount of sauce here, but it, it doesn't overpower the other ingredients. I can really taste the cheese. Uh, the onion rings are nice and crunchy and they're tasty. This is a solid 4.5 out of five. So there you have another 4.5 out of five on the night. Uh, you might be able to hear a little bit of what's going on in the background. I apologize. That is Cheap Trick playing like all of 50 yards away from us and we didn't know, so we didn't buy tickets. So we missed out on Cheap Trick. Uh, Juan, you want to try them, them unicorn fries at this point? Let's do it. Looks like there's a, uh, that looks like a giant, uh, tater tot. And it looks like there's like pico de gallo and some kind of mayo-like topping there. Maybe ranch. It's a questionable look on Juan's face. Looks like he's trying to decipher. Tastes like a really soft bonus chicken wing. There's some level of potato in here as well. You can clearly see that. There's the fries and it looks like there might be some kind of taters in there as well. I was unaware of the chicken, but apparently there's chicken. You ready to render a verdict? You know what? I think this is even better than the burger. This is a five out of five. There you have it. Juan's first five out of five. Better than the burger. The unicorn fries. So if you're going to be at the LA County Fair, although Juan has a caveat. I just want to make sure that people know that it's not on the menu, I think. I didn't see it up on the menu, so 
Yeah, it doesn't seem to be on the menu at the Tasty Burger. So just remember the name Unicorn Fries. Uh, with that being said, I think we're going to let Juan continue to have his... Uh, his meal because uh, none of us have had a, a proper meal all day and uh, we'll get back to you with some more nonsense food from the LA County Fair. This is hot Cheetos with cheese, but this time it's on a bed of fries. So let's have a taste. That's the stuff that boyhood memories are made of. These are fantastic. If you come down to the fair, make sure you have them. Mmm. I'm gonna keep eating them. All right, guys, so we had an issue with the sound here too. And unfortunately, I'm gonna have to say goodbye to you from the future. In this clip, uh, I'm telling you that it's just after 11 and we are wiped out and it's time to go home even though we had a blast at the fair. We checked out some awesome food. We also checked out the animals. Uh, we checked out the rides. If you have time, to stop by the LA County Fair next year, you should definitely do it. If you're in California, a resident, or if you're gonna be visiting, come check it out. Until next time, bye guys.